Hey guys and welcome back to a new video. In this video I am going to be doing a back to school clothing inspiration kind of video. Just different ideas for what you could wear back to school whether that be on the first day or the first week or the entire school year. It's just a bunch of different ideas on how you guys can do that. I hope you guys enjoy this video. It was really fun to make and put together the outfits. Also if you're wondering why I'm wearing a dad sweater it's freezing in my house. I'm just accepting it. But I really hope you guys enjoy this video. It's really, really fun. And I really wanna give a quick shout out to my friend Emily who helped me film the entire thing. She is such a sweetheart for helping me. I am so appreciative of that. Also, if you guys like how my hair and my makeup looks right now, I actually just filmed a tutorial for that, so that will be going up within the next couple days. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please let me know which outfit is you guys' favorite in the comments. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get into it. First outfit is super super cute for back to school. It's the perfect casual back to school outfit for those days where you want to look put together but you're really just not feeling very put together. So I decided to pair this striped shirt with some leggings and people who say leggings aren't pants, you need to just reevaluate your life because leggings are so so comfortable and look awesome with pretty much everything. So I decided to pair this striped shirt with a denim kind of button up loosely thrown over the top. This is great for school especially when the AC is blaring and you're really really cold in class. At least that seems to be an issue at my school. And another thing I loved about this outfit is that you can pair it with some really cute statement necklaces and watches and for me glasses It's just very very versatile for styling and yet again It's one of those outfits that looks really really put together, but in reality is not. Oh, <laughs> it's so comfortable to wear to school I think it's just a really really fun Back to school outfit because it kind of shows off your style and lets you pair a lot of really fun prints together But you do not have to be worried about um, kind of giving up your comfort factor to be able to look cute this next outfit is honestly one of my favorites and it's probably what I'm going to be wearing on my first day of school and it is this super cute sundress. It's perfect for that time of the year, kind of a transitional period between summer and fall and it's so cute. It's patterned. It's honestly just such a fun top but if your school has dress code and does not let you wear spaghetti straps like this, it's the perfect type of dress to be able to style some type of oversized sweater over it but you don't need it. It's really really pretty um, but yet again I understand the dress code does exist but when it is hot outside it is is a nice kind of dress to be able to throw on something over it and it still feels airy and cute and just kind of the kind of flowy part of the skirt is really great for pairing pieces so I really love the colors of this dress and another reason why I really love this outfit is because you can pair it with a hat the red maroon in the skirt really is fun to be able to accessorize with whether that be an oversized statement necklace or in my case a really cute floppy hat I really love how this outfit looks and it's gonna be so fun for my first day of senior year but yeah I I think this outfit's just really fun. This outfit is perfect for the people who don't really want to do something kind of crazy on the first day of school. I understand yet again dress coats are a thing so if you can't wear crop tops that's the nice thing about this outfit is that you can pair it with any graphic tee you want. This one I got from Forever 21 and it says don't be a fool in a kind of um, embroidered heart and I think it's so so fun and the shorts really make this outfit perfect for back to school because although you are going to stay cool with the shorts and the crop top um, you can always throw on an oversized flannel to kind of cool down the piece which I really love. Staples of the school year always for me include flannels. I love flannels. They're the perfect pieces for back to school. You can always roll up the sleeves. I always roll them up twice and just push it past my elbows and it's so great for back to school. It's nice because you can pair it up if you want to remain a little bit colder. You can throw on the flannel or you can just take it off and use it as an accessory piece. So I really love this outfit. You can get graphic tees from wherever and just kind of make it your own. I love the green flannel. I think it's so different to all the red flannels that I seem to always wear. So I just really love the color contrast between the white shirt and the green flannel. Here I am trying to be studious. I love this outfit. I think it's so cute. I bought this sweater for back to school. It's one of the only back to school pieces I bought. It is this green and blue oversized sweater with a pocket. I think it's so good for back to school, especially when you pair it with black jeans like I did. In this outfit, I just love the color contrast. It really brings attention to the sweater. And it's such a comfortable sweater. It's great for back to school. Yet again, it's one of those outfits where you look put together, but you really feel comfortable and you are in a right mindset to study. Here I am yet again, pretending to be studious, pretending that I'm smart enough to be reading a calculus textbook, but I really do love how this outfit looks and how it turned out. It's such a fun back to school outfit and you can pair it with basically any oversized sweater or any dark pair of jeans. 
outfit is great for back to school. I love the color scheme of kind of these pastel colors matched together. The ripped jeans are from Forever 21 and they are so comfortable. I love boyfriend jeans. And I decided to pair it with this blush kind of colored t-shirt and my Anna Ciccone, um horoscope necklace, which I really, really love. I love the rose gold with this look. I feel like it really adds to the color scheme of it. And it's really just a bright, fun back to school outfit if you're looking for kind of lighter toned colors. So these are all of the outfits side by side. Please comment down below which one you guys like best. I just like being able to see them all next to each other to kind of compare the different outfits and what they all look like. So that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And yet again, do not forget to comment down below what is your favorite of the outfits that I had in this video. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.